Sawateka! You've joined us here in Krabi. Uh, we got here late last night and just a kind of quick stop before we head over to Kopipi and that sort of stuff. Um, interesting journey getting here because it involved us getting a minibus, uh, a bus sort of coach, uh, a ferry, another bus sort of coach thing, um, a pickup truck on the back of a pickup truck. That and was fun. A public bus, uh, which was pretty pretty crazy. Yeah. That was the cool. last one probably being the most memorable. Yeah, definitely. This girl behind me tried to this cheeky little so and so tried to prize open my bag. So obviously I was having none of it and had my arm over it for the rest of it. And that then meant that I was not sleeping for the rest of that journey. My eyes were fixed on the bags. In addition to this, the bus driver was going pedal to the floor for the entire journey. So, so fast. It's ridiculous. It's like it was on Fast and Furious. We were overtaking like trucks that were going at least like 70, 80 mile an hour with oncoming traffic coming the other way, which you didn't seem to care too much about. Because it was a public bus, they'd be able to show the passengers on the ground that they're going to come and stop in a minute and they'd be able to get people out of the way so the whole the whole journey is just it's, it's nuts but most importantly we got here in one piece so now it's time to check out co pp and the surrounding islands including maya bay bring it on <laughs> That's it for Koh Phi Phi, and as well as having a nightlife that definitely rivaled Koh Phen Yang, I'd say the scenery and the snorkeling is by far the best I have ever experienced. So we went on a trip around all the islands around Koh Phi Phi, and uh, we got to stop off a load of places for snorkeling. One of them being the infamous Maya Bay, where uh, Leonardo DiCaprio's uh, massive blockbuster The Beach was there. So for all you film buffs out there, great place to go. That was awesome. We got told before we went there that it might have lost a bit of its touch and a bit of its sort of magic because it's such a busy uh, tourist attraction now. But yeah, it was busy. There was lots of boats sort of taking up a lot of the shoreline. But I'd say do it anyway, that's still great. But yeah, that's it for Koh Phi Phi, the Thai islands and actually Thailand. For now. True, for now. But tomorrow we head to Cambodia. Sunburn. <laughs>